Today, faith leaders are demanding a commitment from the Democratic National Convention to help provide funding for Chicago's unhoused. They held a protest to push that effort forward. NBC 5's Courtney Sisk explains what's behind the backlash. What do we want? Money, Money for the homeless. Now. Thursday morning on West Jackson Boulevard downtown. Are no DNC. No DNC. Dozens of protesters demonstrated against the Democratic National Convention coming to town without a promise to help the homeless in Chicago. We don't want you to come here, spend millions, leave here, and we got the same damn situation before you came here. Father Michael Flager hosted today's protest. He says he's had conversations with DNC chair and Chicago native Minion Moore to demand the convention and current administration address Chicago's unhoused before coming in August. According to Chicago's Coalition for the Homeless, there were 68,440 people experiencing homelessness in 2021 and Chicago's public schools says 12,000 of them this year are CPS students in temporary living situations. That makes no sense when we have money where we can hold conventions and spend millions of dollars to party while my friends right now real time are in a park right now. This comes the same week as the U.S. Senate passed a $95 billion national security package for U.S. allies abroad. Chicago faith leaders say there's no reason to not spend more money on homelessness right here. The bulk of the foreign aid money would go to Ukraine, Israel and Taiwan with humanitarian assistance for Gaza. If we can come up with billions of dollars for war, then we ought to come up with billions of dollars to feed and to house people in this city and in this country. And what better place to start than in Chicago, Illinois? Reporting in the Loop, Courtney Sisk, NBC5 News.